this video, we're talking about identity properties or what we call the identity numbers. There's a specific identity number for addition and there's a different identity number for multiplication. The identity number for addition is zero. So for addition, the identity number is zero. For multiplication, the identity number is one. And we call these the identity number because we can always add zero to something and it will keep its identity. In other words, its value won't change. We can always multiply by one and whatever we're multiplying won't change. It'll keep its identity. So in other words, these numbers have no effect on the identity when we're adding zero or when we're multiplying one. So for example, if we wanna simplify these expressions, x plus zero is still gonna be x. This x keeps its identity even though we've added zero. x multiplied by one is still x, so even though we multiplied by one, x still keeps its identity. Adding zero and multiplying by one don't change the identity, so zero is the identity number for addition, and one is the identity number for multiplication. We can do this with small numbers. Four plus zero is still four. Four times one is still four. And we can do it with big numbers. 1,000 plus zero is still 1,000. 1,000 times one is still 1,000. We can also do it with variables. So it doesn't matter what we apply these identity numbers to, we're still gonna keep the identity of the original value. So x, y, z plus zero is still x, y, z. And x, y, z times one is still x, y, z. So the identity number for addition is zero. The identity number for multiplication is one.